Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another Dollar Tree haul. I hope you're doing well. Um, I wanted to share some of the things I picked up from Dollar Tree with you guys. It's kind of late at night but I figured might as well do it. Um, I did do a live video earlier with you guys today. In case you missed it, I'll include a card up above so you can check it out. But without further ado, let's show you all the things I was able to find from Dollar Tree. So I've got my two little reusable bags that I got from Dollar Tree. Let me show you what I was able to find. Some stuff, um, I've it's a repurchase, but you know, other things are kind of new. It's, just stuff I wanted to try. So I did pick up two more of these flap ties from Good Sense. They are lemon scented. This is a repurchase and I love them so much. I love the lemon scented bags. They're awesome. They are pretty good quality for a dollar and you cannot beat this. Walmart can't even beat the prices here. So I had to pick those up. I also don't really have this organized, so it's a little random, so I hope you guys don't mind. I did pick up these glitter gel pens, and these are kind of like a little mini version. Um, and I wanted them for my little container I picked up from Five Below. It's like a little lavender, looks like a caboodle. So I did get these for that in mind. Um, and I'm trying to get a few more like miniature pens and highlighters and markers for that. And I'm curious to know if these will work. I'll have to test them out for you guys in a minute. Flames, they're premium, quick dry, and glitter ink. So we'll have to try that. Okay, you guys, I have been having some stressful times at work lately. So I figured I can get some cute stuff to have around my desk just to bring me the slightest bit of joy so I found these and I thought these weren't that girly like unicorns and mermaids or like you know that kind of girly these are feathers so I figured feathers are kind of professional right I don't know you guys let me know but regardless I thought I would use them um, so they're these they've got little pastel feathers so this one is a notebook and this is a little notepad so I just thought this I mean I feel like this isn't that girly somewhat girly but let me show you what do you think is it girly is it that girly you guys Anyway, I can just flip it over like this, and whenever I'm having a stressful moment, I can just go like this, right? <laughs> it comes with a black gel pen. It is so darling, you guys. I just, come on, that is so cute. I'm really not a feather kind of person, but I really bought them because I thought they're not that girly. Do you know what I'm saying? Does that make any sense to anybody? Let me take this one out of the plastic. This one is magnetic. I don't know, I just thought it would be nice to have on my desk. Look at that, with a little ribbon. Like this would be such a cute gift for a coworker or somebody that is doing an amazing job at work. How cute would this be? With maybe like a little lotion or the hand sanitizer that I hauled in my last video. Like how darling would that be? And just maybe right on the first page, like, thank you for all of your hard work. Thank you for being the best coworker. Like, let's thank those people that are, like, stressing out with us, you know? Because it's a battlefield out there. <laughs> all right. Next, um, I did find this LA Colors setting spray. I am curious to try this. What do you guys think of this? Is this any good? I've lately been really enjoying the LA Color stuff, so I'm hoping this is good. Does this have a scent to it? Wow. That spray is pretty direct. It's a little strong. It's not 
bad. Can't really pinpoint that scent, but it, it's got a little bit of a scent. So far, so good. Claims to help extend makeup wear. That'll be great in my little makeup bag for work. Just if I'm feeling kind of like like I'm sleepy or something, just spritz that on. What do you guys think? Anything to make the girl feel better, right? Okay, I also found this. This is new at my Dollar Tree. Um, this is the Pure Silk Shave Cream Ultra Sensitive fragrance and dye free for reduced irritation. I thought I would haul this for you ladies that have, you know, kind of sensitive skin and stuff. I don't have sensitive skin, but I figured I would try it. It does have like, I believe this is aloe vera, which I love. So I'm assuming this is going to be phenomenal just says reduces irritation formulated with aloe did i just not say that thyme papaya and willow bark the rich and moisturizing smooth glide formula leaves your skin looking and feeling as smooth as pure silk manufactured by piero inc from the makers of barbasol so We'll have to test that. I'll have to let you guys know what I think. Um, I don't even know what happened to my other one, you guys. I've been having a life crisis. I don't know where my stuff goes. Every time I go to Dollar Tree, I pick up some treats for my doggies because I love them. These are the wave, Wavy Bacon Flavor, produced in USA glo from globally sourced ingredients. Um, are these made in China, you guys? I don't know. I, my dogs really like them. I mean, I buy treats everywhere. I, if I go to Marshalls, I'll buy them treats there. If I go to Walmart, I'll buy them treats there. Like, I'm always changing it up. But every time I go to Dollar Tree, I do pick up a treat bag. But I buy them treats, literally, you guys, from everywhere because I love my dogs. They're like my, they're like my children. They really are. They're human. Okay, what else did I get? I did get this, you guys. I was really excited about this. Um, I did use up my other one that I hauled from Dollar Tree. I believe it was Salon Selective's body wash. And it was okay. I didn't think it was like super strong, like, like that the scent lingered on. So I'm hoping this one's a little bit stronger than that one. Um, but it wasn't terrible. It did like bubble up and everything. It was quite nice. I don't really have any negative thing to say about it other than it didn't linger long enough for me. So I'm hoping this one does. This is the Clar and Danver Nourishing Cherry Blossom for Women Body Wash. And I smelled this at Dollar Tree and it smells wonderful, you guys. You have to give this a sniff. Wow, this is like body, Bath and Body Works level. I'm not even kidding. I really hope they have a lotion like this. Oh, that is, that is amazing. I never thought to give it a sniff until this time, but because I had seen these there before. So when you're at Dollar Tree, give it a sniff. It smells wonderful. I'll have to test it out for you guys to see if it lingers on, but goodness, that smells so good. And I love this packaging too. It kind of reminds me of my phone. My phone has cherry blossom on it. It was literally right here the whole time. Cheers. I love Arizona green tea, you guys. Love it. Look. Look at my phone case, you guys. It's a cherry blossom. I got it at the mall because they don't actually make these phone cases anymore because I really need a protective case because I've got a kid and she's crazy. So this one's really good from the mall. If you have like an old school iPhone like I do, that's the place to go. I love my phone till this day. It's a little on the slow side, but I still really like it. 
Okay, moving right along. I found, I was looking for this. I've been watching a lot of cleaning videos and I forget who recommended this. I literally just subscribed to her. Let me see if I can pull it up because I really have been enjoying her cleaning videos. I hope this doesn't take me forever because <laughs> I'm trying to make this fast. But I really want to recommend her channel because I was like really enjoying her videos. They put me in the mood to clean because ain't nobody like to clean. Where is it? Oh, and I've also been really enjoying this lady who does um, gardening videos. Her name is Garden Answer. And I believe her name is Laura, like me. So if you're into gardening, I really recommend her. What's her name? Jessie Christine. She recommended these. So I was watching one of her videos and she used it, I believe, when she was cleaning her bathroom. And I was like, girl, I think I've seen that at Dollar Tree. So she did say they have them at Dollar Tree. So I was like, heck yes, I'm going to pick up some fabu. I literally just hauled some for the bathroom but you know what i can haul all the fabuloso in the world because it always comes to good use and it makes my house smell wonderful and it smells clean and i love it it smells like a really clean home and i love it so much but yeah subscribe to her i really have been enjoying her cleaning videos and i know you like to watch some of my cleaning videos which i haven't done in a minute but she's a good one to watch Okay, I got some uh, sal de uvas. My dad would always make me this, like when I was like not feeling well. He would give me some sal de uvas, and he actually drinks this a lot because he's got like upset stomach or he doesn't feel good. He'll just drink this. So it's citric acid. I wonder what else it's good for. It's good for. Why is this in Spanish? indigestion, heartburn, or if you're just uh, have an upset stomach. This is in Spanish. So I'm trying to translate it for you, but it's called picot in, in English, but we call it sal de uvas in Spanish. And I really like this stuff. I'm going to take some to work. I'm going to put some in like a goodie bag. Let me know if you would like to prepare that with me together, because I think that would be fun. Um, I'll probably end up doing it right after this video because I just feel like we're connected lately. Extra connected. Um, I got some detangler for Leilani in Cotton Candy. This is the Barbie one. It smooths and detangles. And I really like the, the stuff. I always buy it. And it smells like cotton candy, which is a plus. One of my favorite scents. I also got a Vaseline Rosy Lips. I really like the green one, you guys. But they didn't have it. And they had it at Dollar Tree. So I decided to pick it up. This is also going to go in our work bag. That we're going to kind of put together. So that we feel better about ourselves when we go to work. Because don't we want that? We all want that. Okay, I did go a little pen crazy, but who doesn't love fun, cute stuff like me? We share this same Dollar Tree planner, cutesy passion. So, hello, my name is Laura. I love cute things like this. Nice to meet you. I hope you stick around. These make me so happy. So I'll go through them with you. This is a little squishy donut with sprinkles. Can you see it? It's like a slow rise type of little squishy. I can't believe I found these. Um, that's new. I've never seen that before. I also found this looks like it's a cookie of some sort with purple frosting. It's a novelty pen. I have, I do collect these novelty pens. I'll have to show you my collection because it's getting pretty crazy from Dollar Tree and 99 cent store. Here's a pink donut with pink frosting and like white sprinkles. It's very cute. And then this is a cookie with like teal frosting. Oh my goodness. And on here it says five and up. 
so we're well covered girls these are the unicorn pens i didn't think i was going to find these they're absolutely gorgeous they have them at temecula california if you're around but um oh my goodness i had to get two in the pink this is like a purpley blue and this is like a teal they are so pretty you guys i have some that are like mermaid tails that are like this so to find the unicorns like oh my goodness you have to get this stuff if you love stationery you guys you gotta go to the dollar tree you're missing out big time if you love stationery because stationery can get pricey it's can be a pricey hobby like at joann's and michael's go to dollar tree that's the way i do it um for all my planner necessities but I do have a lot of fun. I do have a blast at Dollar Tree. Okay. This is a secret powder fresh solid deodorant for my work bag that we're talking about. If I feel like I need a little bit of a refreshment, I have that. I don't... Sometimes I feel like we spend so much time at work. You need to have this stuff to feel good to be there, you know? So... That's what I've learned. Got this Wet n Wild uh, lipstick in Breeze. I believe the shade is called Breeze. So let me show you. I don't know that this will look good on me. I think this would look really good on fair skin. But I always layer my lipstick sometimes. I'll wear like two lipsticks until I get the desired look. This was new. I hadn't seen this color there before. But this will look so pretty on a fair girl, you guys. It's like a nudish pink. You get you your Jaclyn Hill cosmetics right here, you guys, for a dollar. <laughs> I'm not going to pay $300 for all those lipsticks. Are you kidding me? I can go to the Dollar Tree and get $300 worth of items. So here it is. Jaclyn Hill cosmetics very cute i love it i think this is going to be a total score for me and it is kind of like a sh like a satin finish it's definitely not matte but i've been really into the satin finish lately let's see if i can put this over top it's cute i like it it almost it looks like a little bit of a gloss i like it i think with fair skin though it would look beautiful okay moving right along i found this it's a little wall sticker um the wall art they have at dollar tree it says dance with fairies swim with mermaids ride a unicorn and chase rainbows this is the first time i had ever seen this there i really like all of their wall stickers you guys it's definitely a yes in my book like all of this so in case you're kind of hesitant about buying them like definitely buy them they're worth a dollar they are removable very easy to remove they don't ruin your walls you can use them for your planners or other things these are something i would recommend at dollar tree along with a million other things um, you don't have to shop expensive something like this at target would be like 9.99 I've seen them at, I think, is it Home Depot for their wall stickers? They're like $9.99, which is ridiculous. That's why I only shop Dollar Tree. <laughs> I refuse to pay more than a dollar for stuff that you can literally be finding at Dollar Tree. Okay, moving right along. I got some of these Brim's pork rinds. Some chicharrones. They also had like a spicy version. What I love about Brims is that they'll put a, a Bible verse on their bags. So this one here says, For the Lord is good, his mercy is everlasting, and his truth endures to all generations. So I really appreciate like a little reminder. I like their Brims. I believe they're cheese puffs. They're really good. Or cheese curls no cheese puffs for sure i really like those 
All right, um, I found some stickers for all of my planner lovers. So let me show you the ones I found. These are new, I'd never seen them there before. This one says Flamin' Good Vibes, like Flamingo. Um, this one here says Can't Touch This because it's a little cactus. Let's Hang Out, and he's hanging from this tree branch. Unique, like unicorn, like unique. Eat more whole foods, the little donut. You're so cool, the little ice cream cone. Slice, slice, baby, the little piece, or the little slice of pizza. Oh, snap, the little camera. Every now and then, I fall apart, the little taco. And I think this says be yourself, but I need to flip this over. So, very cute stickers. I got two of these because I've never seen stickers this cute at Dollar Tree. So I had to get those. And then I also found these. Um, these say, remember, keep it simple, important, uh, to do. And they've got little butterflies. I can't believe how creative Dollar Tree is getting with their planner supplies. I'm telling you, if you're a planner lover like I am, you have to, you have to check Dollar Tree out, you guys. You just have to. They come with 58 stickers for a dollar. This one here says, I love you. This would be perfect for Valentine's Day. Big day, I like you, love. Such cute ones. This one says, to do, important, love it, remember, holiday, birthday, start. And it's got little arrows. It's got everything, you guys. So this is more of like a watercolor finish, but I really like it. And then another butterfly one because that one was my favorite one. But they did have like an ocean one with like, I think it was a little seahorse. And I believe one was like a travel one. They had several, but I just picked up my favorite ones. I got some movie theater popcorn, my favorite kind of popcorn. Um, we just were running really low. So this comes three bags for a dollar. It's also nice to have for guests. Um, everybody will always say yes to popcorn when I have people over. I wasn't going to pick this up. This is like the llama little letter set. It includes two cards, four letters, and six envelopes. But I mainly wanted it for this little baggie here. This one here. So I paid a dollar for this. I mean, I still got all the other stuff, which is not bad. But I mean, I think these are perfect to protect like your passport or your car goodies, um, like your car paperwork, um, anything like that, coupons, you name it, receipts, very cute to have. But it does have these little llama sheets, the little no problema letter, um, what do you call these, cards, which I will use like for my handbags. I always like to send out a little thank you note with every single purchase. Um, I do like to send a little thank you card to you guys. I did get a bunch of candy to have at my desk. These are the Mentos individually wrapped chewy mint candies. So I got two packs of those. It includes strawberry, orange, and lemon. This is a Russell Stover strawberry cream in white fudge. Um, I got that. It's a 2.95 ounce little baggie. I also got these. I know I really like these because I've purchased them before. My favorite one are the strawberry ones. But it also has peach and blackberry. They're by the brand Coastal Bay Confections. Creamy delight hard candy. So I do like the hard candy and the mints to have at my desk. And then I also want to have some cough drops because lately I've been getting the cough on and off, on and off. So I like to have this at my desk. This one here is the herbal cough drops compared to active ingredient in Ricola. They're gluten free. They do have menthol. You get 18 drops for a dollar. Cough suppressant and oral anesthetic. Naturally soothes sore throats. And then this one is the honey lemon cough drops. 
soothes sore throats, temporarily fights coughs, and it does have menthol, and you get 25 drops in this one. So I got that for my desk. I also got this for my work bag in case I get a headache or I just start to feel like my body's aching or something. This is a, like a little pick-me-up Alka-Seltzer, um, also good for heartburn, upset stomach, acid and digestion with headaches and body aches. So I'm going to stick that in my work bag and hopefully you'll join me for that. So make sure you're subscribed, hit the notification bell, you're not going to want to miss it. Leilani picked up some lollipops. This was not me. All right, you guys, that basically concludes my Dollar Tree haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you saw something that you liked. Let me know in the comments what you guys have been finding at Dollar Tree. I also asked this in my live video, but I'd be interested to know from the rest of you when you're sad or when you're upset or frustrated, what do you do to be happy? What cheers you up? What makes you happy? I'd love to know in the comments. I know I heard from some of you in the live, but I'd be interested to hear from the rest of you. So that is it. I hope you're all doing well. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.